Seven to the back, left turn three four zero over two departure. Number three three zero zero golf, can you take an immediate? Yes, sir. Number three three zero zero golf, fly runway heading runway five right clear for takeoff. Traffic's regional jet uh, about two and a half mile final. Okay, runway heading clear to go five right three three zero zero go. All right, we'll make it quick. I see him out there. Power's coming up. Power is set. Hold pressure's good at just showing a little high for some reason. That's all right. There's 80. And yeah, 90. Positive rate. We're gonna, we're gonna get our prop back. Get somewhere in there. Get all damp out. Heading. Not working. My electric trim is not working. What's up with that? And then we'll go vertical speed. November 3300 zero, zero, Golf, proceed on course to Shiloh. Contact departure. Good. Okay, on course to Shiloh and over to departure 330. Go. Good day. Set the 72 back, turn left on course, what's the same airport? Back turn left on course, what's the same airport? We'll go ahead and pull our props back to 25 inches to you. Greensboro departure bearing 3300 Gulf 2.3, climbing 3000, undering shadow. Bearing 3300 Gulf, Greensboro departure radar contact, the FRF to your discretion. Zero, zero, go. So we'll go up to 3,600. I'm going to go. Hey, my lighter chip is not working. We're going to see if I can get that to reboot there. So we're going to go direct. Citation 6 here, Tango Flooding 230, vector Activate. to the downwind, to send a maintain. Go six nav. Hey, right turn, get her right to And uh, what was that uh, heading again for 6-0 Tango? Uh, here, Tango heading 230, and maintain 6,000. Is on. Oops, I, I knew I was going to do that. Hey, cameras are not mounted in a good spot. All right. Electric trim. Still not working. Let's turn on the boat and see if he works it. Two to go. Citation six here. Tango to center maintain four thousand. Four thousand. Cal flaps are still open. We're just going to leave them open. Altitude is captured. Let's see if he trims. He's not trimming. Outside of Greensboro, we'll cancel. And I'm going to pull my power back a little bit. I went 
heading there now. I'm going to turn a little bit. Oh, my GPS might Let's go back to heading there. Citation 6 here. Tango is to the maintain 3000. Turn left heading 140. 3000, left turn 140. 6 or Tango. Set the set back to that. You get one to the same airport site. That keeps flashing. Set back, back. we have a flash on the airport site. Okay, you just have to set Roger, contact with the tower, Sam. Yeah. Back contact with the tower, have a good day. Press 33, zero zero call, radar sure terminate squad, BFR, see ya. Zero zero call, we'll talk to you on the way back. BFR, yeah. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to bug it over this way a little bit. I'm going to go and turn the sky out to the guys that fuel flow thing. Procedure. Activate approach because it's going to worms. Safety County, Justin, there, Mike, hang on, turn left down, one down with your big safety county. Somebody's up there at 500 above us at 4,000 doing something too. Shiloh traffic bearing 3300 Gulf's about 9 miles to the south inbound for the approach for runway 31. Anybody in the area please advise. Traffic air track 324, turn the final, first six, let's go, Henderson. He's at 4,000 going that way, so I think he's doing the approach, but he's not on the racetrack, so we'll see. Davidson County, Southern Center, there, Mike Tango, turn left, base runway 06, Davidson County. So now, 94690 up on the 650. Now look at the chart down here. Profile. We can set 2400. 2400. We're going to hit VNAV. That arms the VPATH. I'm going to have to keep an eye on this guy. But look, a good example of an approach for this, he'd be saying, mate, uh, cross firms that are above 3600 clear for the approach. So now that I've already set up my VNAV stuff, I can hit the approach button. And all that does is arm the glide path. If we were doing an ILS, it would also arm the localizer. But since it's already in GPS mode, since we're flying in GPS, that's already green. Green. Yeah, it's fuel pressure. Keeps exiting out. So this guy's going away, I guess. He's at the wrong altitude for what he's doing, but that's all right. Here he is here. Here he is over here. He's on all our displays. But we're looking good. I'm going to try to press this guy, though. This my yoke is a little... There we go. Is that better? Alright. One. Two. That will try to sink the... Oh, yeah. Uh, Travis, you're trying to be 24 on the go. Alright. So we're two miles from Berms. Traffic bearing 3300 Gulf, we're over berms. Going to be procedure turn outbound. Doing the low approach from my 31, shall we? We'll leave room to turn on my 31. Traffic 3406, say 5 miles. Traffic bearing 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 3406, say Yeah, 
here they're going outbound and firing, so we'll keep you advised, you shouldn't be a factor. Here at top of descent. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Top of descent. So we're at 36, it's going to go down to uh, 24. And I'm going to pull up the chart. Contact, contact, 295, left and we just need to be at 24 before we get to Clute. Or at Clute is fine. Clute is the final approach fix. So when we turn inbound, before we get to Verms, because we know at the top of the center it's going to start down, we're going to configure a little bit, you know. This is traffic here, shot 324, short approach. Right, 315. I can't tell with that. Line off, sir, we'll tell Papa Charlie. Uh, 15, 15 miles to the west, inbound. Henderson, Crochet 295 in the left downwind for runway 6 to the solo Henderson. Shallow traffic bearing 00 Gulf inbound on the RNAV 3 1. Approach, just low approach only, shallow to 3 1. Alright, we try to make it clear for VFR traffic because there's a lot of guys that. Fleet North South Carolina, 2390, bump on left down for 3 2. We're going to depart on the downwind to the east. Fleet North. Alright, looking good. See, we're following the racetrack pretty good. We're inbound. You can see by my course it says we're going to Verms and then Clute, so it's not going to hold. Right? If we wanted it to hold, because they said there was a delay or something, we would hit this suspend button yeah, over here, and that would keep us in the hold. It's basically not letting your GPS two. sequence to the next stage. All right. So we're looking good. I'm going to slow down a little bit, maybe 18 inches on my power, because I want to be below 152. How far out I am to shallow, but I could look. Let me look at the chart. We'll see. We'll do some math. So from berms inbound, we're six, nine, ten, eleven, about eleven miles, eleven something. Henderson, crew track two nine five on final four runway six full stop. Um, so to the solo, Henderson. All right, here we go. Before we come to it, before it comes in, our speed is good. I'm going to get one notch of flaps. 15 degrees. It's going to try to balloon. I'll kind of hold it to help them. Davis County, 322 Echo Foxtrot, and a right crosswind turn off the 6, depart to the south. V-pad is County. capturing. Line off, 747 Papa Charlie, 10 miles out to the west, inbound. Shallow traffic, bearing 330 Gulf, about 11 mile final runway 31, low approach, shallow. Now that it's grabbed it, we're going to go ahead and go gear down. Speed check. Three green, three green, three green, three green, no red. Lights are on, flaps are approached. And we're going to stay in this configuration until we broke out, right? Our minimums, which I can set, are 1060. I believe you do it right here, let's see. Minimums. Arrow. Traffic, 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 we would want to be doing 122 so we could get full flaps when we broke out. 
our props we're going to leave alone. And all I'm going to do on the mist, any mist or go around, it's always power, pitch. So you're going to push the B bars to pull the pitch. Power, pitch, positive rate. And if you had full flaps, it would actually be flaps first. So it'd be power, pitch, pull the flaps up to approach. Positive rate, gear comes up. You get to a safe, safely climbing and a safe speed. We're well above, say, 120. So, BYSE plus 10 or so, flaps can come up the rest of the way, and then we'll set up vertical speed. And then the only thing we have to do as far as our avionics is because the mist is in there, this sequence the mist, but when I hit the button and put it in go-around mode, so I have to tell it I want to nav, so I come back to that last, because it's always aviate, navigate, and communicate. We'll aviate, we'll get flying first, we're going to clean it up, get it climbing, navigate by hitting nav, and then we communicate with ATC, say so we're going missed. All right, the final approach fix is Clute. Inbound for runway. I believe it's closer to a six. Oh, they're doing stuff on the right side, maybe. Maybe, unless that's just trees. I don't know. It's hard to tell from here. Shallow traffic, zero, zero gulfs on about a six mile final runway, three one, low approach only. Shallow. So we got three green, no red, lights are on, extra's rich, flaps are approach. So we're going down to 1060. All right, there's where it transitioned from my glide path for the VNAV to it's now it's got the diamond and now it's got the glide path, right? So it transitioned nicely. We didn't have to VNAV. I could have just put it vertical speed and scooch it down to 24. Or I could have just armed the approach and grabbed the glide slope wherever it would have been, and it would have been close to berms. All right, we're going to ease our power back just a little bit more. All right, that means we're leaving our altitude. It turned yellow. So what's our missed approach? Taxi traffic. Three track 285. So now we're going to bug 35. Flying west. All right, for our missed. Right, we're going down to 10 to join left downwind for runway 6, Henderson. 10 So like I said, all it's going to be is power, pitch, or pickle. Some people say pickle. I don't, I don't know where that came from. Ten sixty. So 16 would be 600 feet to minimum. So here we go. Here comes 600 to minimums. Shallow traffic, zero, zero gulf, two mile final low approach from way three one shallow. All right, we're going to 1060, there's 400 minimums. Here comes, there's 300 minimums. Oh, it's just trees out there. They should cut those trees down, that's kind of weird. They've repaved their taxiway. Looks like they're doing a lot of building here. It's been a while since I've been here. All right, here it comes, coming up on 100 to minimums. When he calls, I'm going to leave the autopilot on just to see how it does. And I got my hand on the yoke, obviously, to make sure. Kind of like probably Here it comes, 1080, 1060. Four miles south, minimum landing. Power, pitch, positive rate, gear coming up. Half, and then I can vertical or I can vertical speed it, and we're going to shallow that down to. We're above 122. Flaps coming up. Shallow traffic, track three twenty four, left down one six. Shallow traffic, zero zero gulfs on the go, runway three one. Uh, missed approach. All right, we're going to say activate mist, and then we got it's already in nav mode, so we're going there. Now it's going to go in. All right, it did a good job, right? The main thing on the mist is get active with that. Get active. Just do your little flow. So pitch and power, right? So you're hitting a little go around button, so it pulls your V bars up. Power up right away, so you're powering. Hit the go around button. It knows you're going to dip when they when they plan these approaches. They know that you're going to dip down just a little bit. 
now that we're safe, we can start here. We can use my power back to 25 inches or so. I'm going to come back to my thought, though, here in a second. As I can, you know, you always got to fly the airplane first. But you're always going to do your go-around procedure or your missed approach procedure first, right? Power. If you had full flaps, you're always going to get the flaps up first to approach because it's not going to climb with full flaps. So power. Boop. Pitch to your B bars. Positive rate. Gear comes up. Did. VY plus 10 or so, plus 20, you can get the flaps up the rest of the way, because it definitely climbs better without flaps. And then I'm, I'm, I'm ahead of the curve. We were doing 1,500 foot a minute, so I shallowed that out right away, so I don't get slow. So I'm not kind of hanging on the props, you know? Left downwind, runway one. And then we would tell ATC that we're missed. Talk for traffic, creature Charlie is crosswind going downwind. Full stop, six packs, you back. Right. Alright, we're gonna see if he did. Uh, I don't know if he's trimming or not, or if he's just holding. We're gonna find out here in a second. Attention for traffic air track 285, entering a right teardrop for left downwind for runway 6. Attention. And traffic air track 285, 5 miles to the south west. We're gonna let that downwind traffic. Uh, you guys go by and we'll fly it. Right, we're coming up on our, there's 200 to go, coming up on our 3,500 feet. Try to get my prop sync better. You guys ain't gonna listen to that. There we go. Well, now we're going back that way. Pictures back. Fox for Pendleton, Skyway, and Pendleton. I'm going to pull it back like 17. Side. Side like 18. 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 Head to drive back to track 324, on the go, 600. And 3 Charlie is base, full stop, taxi back, 6. Alright, when we get done here, we're going to go into flight plan. Flight plan. We'll put Greensboro down here while we're just farting around. Okay, oops. Airplane departing on the pattern, or you would, departing the pattern or remaining in the pattern. Head to traffic, we're staying in the pattern. Start crossing now. Hold on. Uh, Skyline Pot Lady, X-Way. Hatch and Wednesday, Sonic. We're behind you, we're moving to the name Y. Hatch and Wednesday, Sonic. 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 Hatch Traffic, air track 3.4, left downwind, first six, hundred. And traffic, air track 285, we're three miles to the west, we're going to go ahead and do a left 360 to the west and get behind that traffic that's on the crosswind turning down when we have you in sight, and there's the traffic. Alright, it's going to hold teardrop. Hold teardrop.
Or we could have went into flight plan, you know, it would be there. But we'll go Regents, uh, approach, ILS-5 right. And you can see, I'm not familiar with this G-500 or whatever this thing is, but it's pretty intuitive. It's all just like regular Garmin stuff, you know. That's nice, nice, nice. We're just 52 in traffic uh, between 12 and 1 o'clock, 6 miles, same direction out to the Cape Coral South. That's kind of nice. We can't do that on some of the old ones. And when we get close... Get close, we're gonna slow down, right? Because I'm doing 178 indicated. And where my true airspeed is, where is that? I gotta find it. There it is, 186. Alright, we're gonna see if we can do a good landing. Hopefully I'll find it. Everybody's recording, everybody's recording. I don't know what we're seeing. We'll try to, we'll try to piece this thing together. Descending. I don't, I, and I'm not talking to him. Turn rating 055. No worries. Right turn 055. We'll shoot with six. I'd rather that fuel pressure either be, either got to be fixed or just turned off because that's annoying. Constantly give you engine warnings when it's not really a real thing. Sure track 471 green. Oh, there you go. It's a trim. But it's still not registering properly. Or at least I don't know. I don't know what the fuel pressure should be. 5286, we got that up here. Mechanics, figure that out. Roger, can you take a visual or do you want uh, me to box you back around? I, I won't be able to give you a legal R and F. I can go direct Pagan for the visual. Yeah, if you don't mind, just bring us back around for training. Uh, how about this? Blue Street 5286, turn left heading 020, join the final. I think uh, that's actually going to work. All right, 020, join the final. Blue Street 5286, thanks. And then the next big thing is how do you get back to the MRO after landing on Drive Right? I guess we're going to go down to Echo. The hotel, the Delta, the Delta Two. Nasal approach mode is six seven eight eight. November starting initial descent. The departure mode is five four two thousand eight hundred. Climb five thousand. Trisha four one right heading. Trisha four. The five four green zero departure. Right. So it's running good though. Running good. Other than this little two thousand fuel pressure. And the electric trim. Blue Street 5286, uh, three, I had that little glitch with the autopilot not booting up. I had to hit the disconnect and let it reboot and fixed it. We're going to get on the ground. I'm going to reset that and see if that fixes it. We're going to get on the ground. I'm going to reset that and see if that fixes it. We're going to get on the ground. I'm going to reset that and see